Hey guys, long time no see. So I just thought I'll uh, give it a few more shots of a couple of videos uh, because there were at least a handful of people who were replying and getting engaged with the content. So uh, here I am back trying my luck out of how engaging the content becomes. Any which way, so I uh, had a very interesting conversation yesterday. So I went for a couple of uh, dealer meetings for an event that we were supposed, we are supposed to host. So one of the dealers and his employee uh, starts talking to me about health and fitness and you know all the nuances around it because again we were talking about our lives, careers and past and how I landed up in Pune exactly. And then uh, the favorite topic of uh, what exactly are supplements, what exactly is whey protein and should one take it or not. So the dealer's employee has a kid who is in class 10th and 12th and uh, both are boys and supposedly both did get into working out and gymming and you know have started pestering their dad about getting them whey protein so to say and uh, then he asked me uh, considering my experience professionally and uh, just as a lifestyle this thing have I been taking supplements all along right so I told him very candidly and honestly yes I have especially since the last five six years right and uh, they didn't want to hear anything after that and uh, traditionally speaking they all went about uh, talking to me about how you know all the badam and you know your cashews your almonds your walnuts can do anything and everything that whey protein can do and i had a very long but after you know my final answer of yes i have been taking whey protein uh, so my but was that no I don't take it as the only source of protein so that's where most people get it wrong they start thinking and uh, uh, putting into their lifestyle uh, considering that uh, whey is the only source of protein that they should be focusing on I try to get my natural source of uh, protein from main foods natural foods like tofu and eggs and uh, paneer and broccoli and mushrooms and whatnot and uh, I take the whey protein as and when needed if i'm already feeling full if uh, i have had enough from on uh, on that particular day and i don't want to feel bloated or i don't want to in in intake any uh, more fluids or liquids or eat anything else i don't take the whey protein right it's not a compulsion that i have to have to uh, take it every single day and as far as my goals are concerned uh, it's pretty sorted when i essentially want need to i take it otherwise i don't and as the name suggests it's a supplement it needs to complement your main nutrition main meals it does not have to be the only source of protein and that's where i think people are getting most confused where they would try to uh, substitute this from natural and whole foods uh, adding to this i also take chia seeds and i'm not saying i have anything against walnuts and almonds and everything like i do take them as well and uh, they have a lot of other uh, macros and micros apart from protein which could add some undue uh, good fats onto your body and not in nutrition so I'm not gonna dwell more on this and they did not want to hear this long but and before I end this video I also wanted to say so that's how I take my whey protein because that's how my goals are I have a, a regular corporate job and uh, i'm not looking at anything but general health when i work out but your goals could be different uh, your health goals fitness goals could be different for sure and uh, depending on that please consult your nutritionist your doctor keep yourself regularly checked if you are if way suiting you or do you want to take plant-based proteins or uh, any other source of protein right so yeah uh, get a nice educated coach if need be also get a nutritionist keep a check and don't overdo anything so cheers for that and have a good sunday good week ahead